today i will read some of the good points which i learned from unlimited power by anthony robbins uh, it is a national best seller i highly recommend to read this book or read everything from uh, about anthony robbins uh, he taught me a lot and one of the most important thing which i learned from him is the is the principle of copying other people beliefs with one of the quotation the grand the great end of life is not knowledge but action anthony Rob, robin said to me success is the ongoing process of striving to become more it is the opportunity to continually grow emotionally socially spiritually psychologically intellectually and financially while contributing in some positive ways to others according to the anthony robbins action is what produce results knowledge is only potential power until somebody uses it so there are some traits which he found in the effective people number 1 is passion all these people who are successful have discovered a reason a consuming energizing almost obsessive purpose that drives them the second trait he found in every religious book on the planet talks about the power and effects of faith and belief on mankind the most important thing i learn is this how we communicate with our own self because we talk a lot with our own self and that is the communication which needs to be changes that how we talk with our own self to model excellence you should become a detective an investigator someone who ask lot of questions and track down all the clues to what produce excellence many people consider the richest man in the world is adnan mohammed khwazgi how did he get that way simple he modeled the rockefellers the morgans and others of like financial stature the kind of behavior people produce is the result of the state they are in how they specifically respond out of their state is based in their models of the world people who have achieved excellence are masters of tapping into the most resourceful part of the brain and is what he believes the people who have changed history whether christ muhammad columbus edison or einstein have been the people who have changed our beliefs to change our behavior we have to start with our own belief system norman cousins who learned first hand the power of belief in eliminating his own illness concludes drugs are not always necessary belief in recovery always is if you believe in success you will be empowered to achieve it if you believe in failure those messages will tend to lead you to experience them as well the question is what kind of beliefs are best to have and how do we develop them you can control your beliefs you can control the ways you model others you can consciously change your try right. to read the beliefs of the most successful people and then model them you can consciously model the beliefs of those who are great leaders by reading their biographies this is an important point abraham lincoln lost some important elections but he continued to believe in his ability to succeed in the long term he allowed himself to empowered by success and he refused to cope by his failure his belief system was geared toward excellence and he finally achieved it belief is the foundation of excellence do not find fault find a solution Henry Ford we know that if you have an emotions it shows on your face now we have seen it goes the other way too you become what you put on your face if you laugh at surface you don't feel suffering inside if your face shows sorrow you do feel it inside if you can get a tape of a martin luther king junior speech and he speak as he speaks duplicating his tonality voice and tempo you may feel a sense of power and strength like never before 
modeling is about creating possibility and there is no faster way more dynamic way than through the f uh, physiology and copying the other people the main thing you now know is that there are no limits to what you can do your key to power of modeling excellence can be duplicated if other people can do something all you need to do it is model them with precision and you can do exactly the same thing one of the discovery that the three person with written specific goals were worth more in financial terms than the entire 97 percent who didn't write their who goals. are the people in your life who can serve as models there are resources in friends family national leaders celebrities if you don't know good models you should make a point of going out and finding someone whom you can copy One of the reason most people don't do well in life is because success is usually disguised behind hard work and goal setting or outcome development is hard Words work are the most powerful drug used by mankind 